Today on this James the Bike Guy, we're taking a look at my custom built Santa Cruz Chameleon. This is a 2018 Santa Cruz Chameleon, custom built with all the parts that I thought would make it into a really great bike. And to start off the conversation, this bike is awesome. It's a ton of fun, it's super playful, it's pretty light for what it is, it runs nice big plus size tires, and if I wanted to, you could also put 29ers on it. In the rear, these dropouts can be swapped for a 29, 27.5 plus, and then you can even do it as a non-boost single speed. But the way this is set up is a 27.5 plus. I'm actually running some WTB Ranger 3.0 tires mounted up on some Mavic XA Elite. These are super wide 40 millimeter rims, nice bladed spokes. These wheels are awesome. They have 40 millimeter wide internal. They're an asymmetric rim, which means the spoke lacing is offset to make sure you have more even spoke tension. And the hub that comes in them just works really, really well. Now on the front, I'm running the Fox Rhythm 34. It's a great match for this fork. It uses the grip damper 15 by 110 through axle on the front and really just makes for an awesome fork on the front of this bike. You've got plenty of uh, damping control as well as rebound control. And to keep the bike in check, we've got the level T brakes. Nice basic brake from SRAM, but it works out pretty well. You don't need a super fancy brake on a bike like this. This bike is gonna be just ripping around, having fun. You're not gonna be going that, that fast that you need something to really pull you down. Now, to make sure I get up the hill, we've got GX Eagle. So G GX Eagle front shifters, and then you've got this 10 to 50 tooth rear cassette so that's basically a 500% range with the awesome Eagle GX derailleur. Shifts super well, made it up front to a nice race face crank with a race face narrow wide chain ring. That all works out pretty well, but of course to round out some of the race face parts, we've got this race face dropper post. So you press the lever, boom, comes right up with a nice aluminum paddle here that almost feels like it's a shift lever. Of course, we're rocking the Santa Cruz grips and a race face handlebar. So handlebar and stem by race face here. But this Santa Cruz chameleon frame, man, it's, it's a showstopper. Works super well. This is a really, really nice bike. I've been having a ton of fun because it's super playful. It's got the benefit of the 27.5 plus wheels. So one of the reasons I have this bike is that it's a perfect complement to my Santa Cruz Hightower. Basically the reason being is I've got wheels that are compatible in both frames so I could swap my Hightower's 29s onto this bike or these 27.5 plus onto my Hightower because I set them up with the same size brakes, the same Eagle drivetrain, and because both bikes are compatible with each wheel size, it really allows me to almost have four bikes just out of two. The other reason I picked this bike up is Santa Cruz's geometry. Just fits super well, it's super confidence inspiring, and it works extremely well for the trail riding where I go. So let me know down in the comments below, what do you think of this build? What are some things you would have changed about it? Let me know if this is a bike that you'd enjoy riding. And as always, click that subscribe button to see more videos like this into the future.